In this video, I'll set up the ConnectWise Manage and ConnectWise Control integration. This integration allows the technician to launch a remote session from within a ticket so that they can quickly connect to the end user. The integration also automatically creates a time entry with session details once the remote session is completed. Before I begin configuring the integration, I need to be on Manage version 2019.4 or later and control version 19.3 or later. I will also need a control remote support license. To begin, I navigate to the system module and open the members screen. I then open the API members tab and select the existing Screen Connect member. I now fill out the required fields and select a role ID with the required security access. I then click the Reactivate button. Once the member has been reactivated, I open the API Keys tab and click the New icon. Next, I enter a description and click Save. I can now see both the public and private keys. I record the private key as it will be hidden upon leaving this screen. Next, I open control in a web browser and navigate to, to Admin, Extensions. I open the Extension Marketplace, search for and select the Manage Integration, and then click Install. I can now close the flyout. I am then prompted to fill in the integration settings. I enter my Manage URL in the top field. My Control URL is entered automatically. I enter the company ID I use to log into Manage in the Company field. Finally, I copy and paste the public API key and private API key from the API member I set up earlier. I then select the features that I'd like to enable in the integration. I can add a time entry on a service ticket after ending a control session. I can save session chats, events, connection events, and notes as an internal note on the ticket, as an attachment, or both. The integration can also combine attachments into a single file, and it can include a link to preview the session in the control host page. To test out all the features of this integration, I select all of these settings. Once I've completed these fields, I click Save Settings. I have just completed setting up the control integration for Manage. For more information, please check out our university documentation.